just killing it in practice preseason and then hurt that ankle. And that kind of slowed his progress down. He's not, his shooting touch hasn't quite come back yet, but he's very capable. Jones, in and out, arms on the rebound. Not to Stir the tempo up. Price Noel misses a corner three. And, and you know, you never know when there's an NBA player, especially one as decorated as Stoudemire in his uh, long run in the NBA. He was the NBA Rookie of the Year. First on the night. Dennis, Acott in the corner. Falling away over Nell. Harms is fouled on the rebound. And the foul's on Milner, and that'll be his fifth. Left to go here in the first half. Averett really botting up on Wooster. Hands over to Anthony on the left wing to Anderson. Anderson back over to Wooster. Gets it to Kata. Kata puts his shoulder down, up, under. Great puts move. Puts the sky shot up, won't go. And the rebound pulled down by BYU. Ashworth Great. to Kata. Kata works it over to Barstow. Barstow hands to Bean. Bean to Kata. Kata's got good positioning once again. Spins out of it. The double team hands to Wooster. Wooster has the ball go off his hands. Out of it here. Down 11, 57-46. 9.52, everything Utah State's thrown at BYU, they've been able to answer. Harms back into the game with an elbow in the back of Keita. Keita still working him down. Keita spins, keeps it himself, right-hand shot, leaves it short. Anthony comes away with a long rebound, though. Anthony back to Wooster. Wooster on the left wing. Barcelo's on him. Wooster drives into the lane. Right-hand scoop shot blocked away by Harms. Goes out of bounds. It'll be 11 seconds on the shot clock. Aggies regain possession. Justin Bean outside the three-point line. Wooster looking for Kata. Kata's got it against Harms. Spins, ups, under. Shot nearly blocked away. I think it was. And Loner comes Kata away. on the left wing. Hands to Bearstow. Bearstow circles right. Back to Bean. Bean being guarded by Loner. Bounce pass to Kata. Kata trying to go to work against Harms once again. Spins right. Puts a shot short. Tipped around. Controlled by Barcelo. Big, but but uh, the key is when you're playing defense like that, you got to be in great position. He was in great position and, and took the contact and went down. Strong drive to the basket. Process can't get it to go down. Harms is grabbing his ankle under the basket. Averett on the other end for three. Drops it in. And Harms is down on a knee under his defensive basket as Averett with five points. Weathers, blocked by Johnson, 20 on the shot clock, after Harding hits the ball out of bounds. Here's Jones, the coach's son, has it taken away by... Shot clock at five, Bell starts, that is a offensive foul. Anybody there defending him, and he missed the layup. Raleigh Wooster comes away with it. Aggies dodge a huge bullet there. Kata back to Wooster. Aggies need somebody to make a play here. Wooster, the floater over the top of Harms, no good, out of bounds, or stays in bounds. play to, uh, to adjust the pace of the game. Anthony tries to drive against Harms. Harms has been a great rim defender. Kata airballs the putback on the offensive rebound. Quickly to Averett. Averett's got an angle, and he'll lay it up and miss it. So long that BYU can just toss it over the top. Here's Walker on the drive, and Harms blocks it and then tips it over to Connor Harding. Here comes Marco Anthony quickly down the court. Anthony to Ashworth. Ashworth cut off on the baseline. Back to Anthony. Anthony, he'll get into the lane. Attack as the shot block goes out of bounds. Harms flexes on him as he should. Rebound and bringing the ball down the court. Keeps it himself. Works baseline right. To Wooster up top, then back to Anthony. Anthony to Bearstow. Bearstow wants to drive, gets around the edge, puts the shot up high, missed it, and Gideon Mike George. Loner does. Anthony to Kata. Kata on the baseline. He'll hand right back to Anthony. 19 seconds on the shot clock. Up top to Wooster. Wooster attacks. Underhand oh, scoop dear. shot. Ooh, over the top of the backboard. Goes out of bounds. But Wooster's like, where's the foul? Inbound to Wooster. Wooster with 10 seconds on the shot clock. Double teamed and then backs off. Six seconds, five seconds. Drives, shot, wow. once again blocked. 
Out of bounds, and it will stay with BYU. Spencer Johnson gets it. Quickly going the other way to Harding. Harding wide open three, no good. Tipped around. They were 23 and 10 and 11 and five. They finished third in the West Coast Conference last year. And of course, nobody went to postseason play with the shutdown after the West Coast Conference tournament. Um, and he's you know, playing himself into understanding what his role is just so late. Averitt for three. That one's off the glass and into the arms of Gillum. Into the basket off the foot of Harms. Uh, look, we all would love to have fans, but you can hear the defense talking right now and the rotations. And numbers on the way for Pacific. Good dish. And Hampshire lost the night. it. Raleigh Wooster on the right wing, coming around a screen. Wooster into lane. Wooster with a right hand layup. Can't get it to go. And Averitt's there with the rebound. Maybe a little bit too much to ask against the 7-3 Harms. Bob inside to Harms. Can't stop that. And it's 6 to nothing. BYU. Harms with four. Harms gets it back. Now Harding. And Harms. I, I love that Harding. I, you can't tell me Harding was Two BYU by one. Bean puts the shot up. Left it short. No good. Nearly gets called for the foul. They'll let it go. Loner comes away with the rebound to Averitt. Averitt drives. Cut off. Travel. Works it back up top to Harms. Straight away three. Yeah, he hits it. Four-point lead for BYU. 26-22. Get into the basket and transition, or when they're attacking the basket in their half court. Harms off the glass. Matt has six. Fell on Jones a moment ago. His first. It's ten. He was up around seventy percent for much of this first half. Is now down to fifty-two percent from the field on twelve of twenty-three. Barcelo, top of the key, lobs into Harms, and Matt the turnaround shot. He sure is a vacuum of a rebounder. He sucks up everything. Harms with a left hand. BYU San Diego State on ESPN2 at 10 Eastern time. It's a big Saturday here on BYU TV and we're looking forward to it. Barcelo into Harms. And Matt does what he does best when he gets the ball. He's got seven. He just hasn't gotten the ball much down there. Ball in, and Loner's out. Lowell into Harms. Has his shot blocked. Gets it back, and it's foul going back up again. And Matt will go to the free throw line. Lee hands it to Barcelo, trying to shake Weathers. Get some help from Colby. Now it's Averitt. Into Harms. Kick back, open three. That extra pass, this one left on the front end. They'll try it again. It's Barcelo off the left. Another look, and it's Averitt. And the foul. The loader, he's double teamed, has to kick it back out. Good look for three. It is up and missed. Coming in for the rebound is Harms. Offensive rebound collected by BYU. Right into the paint to start the game. Down into that post. Texas Southern didn't come over and double team Colby Lee, and he said, Hey, one on one, I'm just going to get to the front of the rim and toss this thing in. Averitt looks to Harms. Let's see if they single up Harms as well. Matt fights his way through the lane, draws some contact. He'll go to the line and shoot some free throws. Tremendous job here in Stockton tonight. Obviously, they're having a rough go of it, but overall, he has done a really nice job. Matt Harms is back in. Bell's leaning on him. And Harms gets fouled and gets free throws. BYU on the road and on we Continue time. to put that pressure on them defensively. Aggies on a 14-3 run, but unable to score points here down the stretch. Harms to Barcelo. You know he's not going to go away quietly. Averett back to Harms on the baseline. Trying to attack Keita. Puts his shoulder down. Goes to work. Spins up, under, fouled. He'll go to the line. Pump fakes, or, uh, you know, shakes his uh, fist, knowing he got Kata. 
BYU shooting under 10% from the free throw line, from the three-point line. Now Harms running into a brick wall, trying to make a maneuver. Gets into the lane, throws it up, and Armish is going to get the foul. Leon Rice is saying, I'd like to travel instead of the foul. Nicholas picks up his first. Alexander had his on the other end of the floor. And Harms drops in the free throw. Matt is a 61% free throw shooter. And he's 2 of 16 from the three-point line. And his head coach continues to remind us that he is a much better shooter than these early numbers. 3 of 5 from the field. Sitting at 8 points right now. And he's 2 for 2 from that free throw line. Averett back in. Marcelo will come out. 2.23 to go here at the half. Our score box is presented by Brady Industries. Supplies and service for cleaning and food service professionals. Brady Industries really honestly. Really good start to this game with his physical presence inside. Now that's his third right here in the first couple of minutes of this, uh, this second half. He picks up number three. Harms picked BYU over Kentucky in the sweepstakes of where he was going to go after picking up his degree from Purdue with a year of eligibility. He believed Mark Pope was the man that would help him prepare to get a job next year playing basketball. NBA quality, Dan Dick. I think David Stoudemire brought that with him. Well, he's a student of the game, always was. We were teammates, as you mentioned. Uh, for half a season in the NBA, and, and he was one of those guys that was always on top of the scouting report, had great insight and input when coaches would ask. That's a difficult catch and finish by Gideon George. Oh, and they say, okay, well, we, they have five guys available. Which five? You know, if it's three guys that never play and two of your starters, I don't know how that makes your team really better moving forward, you know? And, and so, Aver to Harms. Harms to Barcelo. Barcelo kicks it back to Harding, nearly lost it. Then gives it to Harms, who's then posting up against Kata. Aggies don't bring the double team quite yet. Now Bean shifts over, hands over to Loner. Loner will take the straightaway three and knock it down. So close, great move. Yep, Barcelo back to Harding, up top to Loner. Loner's hit three threes tonight to Barcelo on the baseline. Hit a big baseline three against Utah State last year down the stretch. So Loner, Loner's able to collect, kick it back to Harding. Harding for three, yes. There you go, there's your big three, coach. Marcelo to Harms. Now it's Averett. Harms on the move down low. Barcelo for three. Barcelo knocks it in. Great movement for the basketball. With six. We near the seven-minute mark. Harms can't stop it down there. And Harms with 16. And Stoudemire, who, of course, was a star at Arizona, an All-American at Arizona, and they both went into the NBA. Barcelo weaves his way in for a 16-footer, missed it, reloads a three, missed that, harms with a tip. Pick, roll, great ball fake, and a flush. You can't give BYU second chance opportunities. Marcelo continues to expand his game. Not only is he a scorer, he can make plays off of pick and rolls. That time finds harms when Bell stays on the ball handler. So you're going to guard the ball handler in a pick and roll situation and get back to Bell at the three-point line? That is difficult to do. Back to a one-point game. Marcelo splits the double off the harms for two. That was terrific stuff. 221, use that basket as a defender. Yeah, absolutely. Under control, looking good. Loner up top. Keeps it himself. Nice bounce pass down low. Nearly stolen away. Marcelo's got to come away with it. Works it back to Harms, to Harding. Harding on the right wing, back to Harms. Harms finds Barcelo. Barcelo. Tries to go down low to Harms and lays it up and in. Good job, good movement by BYU. Marcelo with it as we near two minutes in a five-point game. 
Averett lobs for Harms. Harms is off the glass. And it's a three-point game, 18 now for Harms.